Good morning, Dan. Hey. It's our the last day of recording. It's time. I'm ready. Cage match. Day three. Day three. Day three. Hi. Yo! Whoa. here with Austin John Plays, of course, and if you missed the last episode, you can check it out in the description below, or head over to Austin's channel as we took down Piers and the Dark Type Gym, which leads us to our next cage match. Yes, and also hearing about how we're a child and we should not worry about all the stuff that Leon's going to take care of because he's the champion and that's what the champion should do. That's what he should do. It would be, oh wait, I've never played the post game, but I was going to say, it'd be really cool if there were things that happened in the world after you become champion that you have to deal with. Don't spoil if that's the post game map. Oh, it's Delmize. I have one too. One percent. Look at that. You ready to cage match? We have a six v six, right? That's really weird that it spawned for both of us. One percent. Yeah. That's a one percenter right there. Yeah, it is. You want a cage match? <clears throat> sure. Hey guys, it's Austin from the future. I need to talk to you real quick. So the end of the last episode when we took on Pierre's, my Corviknight died, and that was the end of recording for day two. Danny and I did very long days of about 10, 12 hours a day, and we were very tired after that. We never took Corviknight off of my team, and going into this episode, we forgot to take him off my team. So we done goofed, and Corviknight uh, isn't isn't gonna isn't gonna be dead going into this episode, and we just forgot that he got knocked out in the gym. So sorry about that, but accidents happen, and it was already recorded, so. Enjoy the cage match. You've got the, a really balanced team, by the way. You have a Firewater Grass and a Fairy Dragon Steel Core, which is incredible when you think about that. Yeah. Austin with the strats or Austin whatever. Austin with the strats or whatever. So what are we right now? We are... I never realized... I didn't realize that you it, made your trainer you winning, card so so bright. Are you four and three? What is... No, this we're... Three and three and two? What, how many How many do we have? We've done six. Six. You've won two. Okay. So it's four to two. Jeez. All right. So, okay, we got a very interesting situation here. I see you, you brought out your neutralizing gas, which yes. I am, I think is very commendable. I wanted to make sure that uh, that wasn't going to be a problem. Are you going to Dynamax out the gates? No. You're going to no. catch a big Thunderbolt here. That's, Not too worried. That's going to do some damage. Not too worried. What are you going to go for now? Oh, he's going to set up the Tailwind yep. for his Galarian Weezing, which can now fire off a big Toxic into my Cursula. Yeah. We're just gonna chip that thing down over the turns here. Yeah, because that thing is gonna be a little rough if it if I don't do something about it like that. We'll go for a big hex. A little hex action. Oh, you're doubling down on the Corviknight. Into the Corviknight, but oh, it does nine not health. get enough. It does not get enough damage off on the Corviknight. No, it does That's not. That's gonna be rough. Take your time, Dan. I'm, I'm just thinking through <laughs> my moves. These are important moves. Here All comes right. the big steel wing. Yep. It, ooh, that did some damage. Yeah, it okay. Did. Here comes the Sludge Bomb, following it up into the Raichu slot. It's going to do about half. No poison, please. Okay. Nope, no poison. And the security. And the Thunderbolt. Nice. Oh, you're going for Weezing. I went for the Weezing. But now you're going to do the Hex on the Corva Squire for the KO. That's what we're going to do. Yep. Corva Knight. Corva Knight. Corva Knight. That's a Knight now. Yeah. All right, comes Grookey Gang. How do you know that? You were looking at my screen. I didn't have to make a decision, so it's okay. Yeah. I'm allowed to do that. Yeah. All right. Sparky is going away. I'm gonna switch out Sparky here. Now, and are you gonna let Cursula go down to poison, or are you gonna you gonna try to chip away at it? Oh, you're gonna go for the big Dynamax on the gang here. Uh, how do you know it was the gang? I'm assuming it's the gang. Weezing's weakest. Because there's no reason to do Weezing. Yeah. Yeah. Here comes the gang. He's a he's a unit. Yeah, he is. He is a absolute unit. unit. He is an absolute unit. That's a loud cry. That is a unit right there. The he has the Dynamax candy too. Oh, he does, he does. And here comes the max overgrowth into the Pontiard slot. Yep. Which is a resisted hit, but it does a but lot still does more of than damage. Half. A lot of damage. And we'll see what this Weezing's gonna do here. That's uh, I did a poison move in a Pontiard, so now it's not gonna do anything. Okay, spoilers. Big sludge bomb coming off. I'm gonna go for that nice little strength sap. Get a little health back. Mm. Yeah. That was a solid move. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because now, I mean, your Dynamax is now weakened. You know? He's, he's not getting the most out of his max now. Yeah. All right. Oh, Marini's leaving. Marini's leaving, and Going we got Liz, Liz coming out. We got Liz. The Weavile. Not yet. Or the Sneasel. Max Darkness, and that's tanked. Yeah, it is. Good stuff, Sneasel. Yeah. Love to see that. Using my type advantages here. But 
The special defense fell. Oh, uh, that's gonna, yeah, you might get the KO. Oh, went for the assurance. I'm resisting that. Sure are. And uh, sure we're going to see the uh, Pawning Art Fire of a nice little Metal Claw actually into the wheezing. wheezing slot. Doing some damage there. Tanked it. You did tank that, actually. You yeah. Did. You did tank that. Pretty good. We got a little recovery here, a little grassy terrain. Your Tailwind is gone, though. You're going to switch Taking out the, the Wheezing, wheezing out. into yeah. the Primarina. Okay. There goes the Neutralizing Gas. We're just going to activate everyone's abilities. Oh, no. There's pressure. There is some There is some pressure here. Here comes the Icicle Crash, and I missed. Oh. Who That's was it on? Grookey Gang. Oh, okay. Gookie Gang. Gookie Gang. My bad. Gookie Gang. Gookie Gang. Oh. I have a tanking. I'm um, actually tanking Just a that. sliver of health there. Nice little chunk of damage. Oh, I get an attack boost. Oh, look at that. We take those. Just take in the, time. Take that attack boost there. Not yeah. bad. Not bad. And I believe that was the end of my third turn of Dynamax. That is the end of your Dynamax. All right. Here comes the turn. Icicle Crash comes off. It actually hits this time. Yeah, you were fast. I mean, Sneasel's fast. That's too bad. I didn't hit the well, last time. I wasn't worried about Gooka Gang. No flinch. Here comes Gookie firing off a drum beating into the Pawniard slot. That is going to pick up the KO on the very low health Pawniard. Yes, it is. And we will see what this Primarine is going to do next. Here comes the Sparkling Aria, which is going to chip all Pokemon on the field, I believe. Yep. Although it only looked like it hit me, and you almost knocked out yourself there. Yeah, but I knew I knew Gookie could take that, no problem. You knew Gookie could take that. Yeah. It's time to unleash Oh, the I knocked power. out both of your mods that turn. You did. You got to double down there. Yeah. But here we go. But most importantly, now you don't have, you don't have a. Uh, I can't. Yeah, I you can't, don't have Sizzle. I can't boost myself. Yes. All right. Here comes the big play. The Dynamax oh, comes Dynamax off from Lucario, Lucario with those Dynamax candies, getting mm. a lot of extra health here. Yes, it is. It is getting a lot of extra health. It's getting larger now, Cotton. It's got a lot of health on this one. There's some extra health involved. There's some health that's extra. Mm. Lucario going to go for the... Now we're going to see the Thunderbolt come off from Sparky into the Primarina slot, doing big damage, knocking it down to about the 20%. And next we're going to see the Max Steel Spike, which is going to go also, also into, into the Primarina, Primarina and pick up the KO and give a defense boost to both Raichu and Lucario. Mm. Now we got some, some boosts. Yep. Got some boosts. Primarina goes down... But and just as important, now we have Gookie Gang going for the drum beating with the speed drop onto Raichu. And to Raichu's the KO gonna onto go Raichu. Ooh, the defense <laughs> boost was not enough. No, it the was not. Defense boost was not enough. I probably was better off taking out Gookie Gang then. Gookie Gang has been on the field for a while now, and the terrain is ended. grassiness has ended. The grassiness. The grassiness, The yes. grassiness has indeed ended. And Marini makes an appearance back on the field, still toxic, still badly poisoned from its last time out here, and we see Weezing creating a neutralizing gas to fill the arena. And also with his two weakened Mons on the battlefield, Lucario is going to be doing a max knuckle to increase the attack and taking out the KL and Gookie Gang. Big crit there, that definitely mattered. <laughs> that crit mattered. And Marini gets a physical attack boost as well. That's going to become very handy. It's probably not going to do anything. It's not going to do it's anything. It's probably not going to do anything. Ooh, this might actually do a lot. Ugh. Alright. We're living, we're living. We're living. The Hex on the Weezing is enough for the KO, and it is. Weezing goes down. So one more turn of Dynamax left for the Lucario. Uh, the... Corsola is very weakened, however, or the Marini, Corsola, the Corsola, and it's down to the final two. We got a double down. We've got an Arcanine and a Dreepy coming out on the field. The final two for Austin. Yep. And it's 2v3, but Austin still has to uh, deal with his Dynamax Lucario. Yes, now, this he Arcanine does. does have the type advantage here with its Intimidate, be able to drop the attack stat that the Lucario just gained from its Max Knuckle, so it's back to neutral. All right, Lucario Max with the wake. When did you learn a ground move? I have Bone Rush. Since when? For a long time. Oh, Arcanine survived on 22 health. Wow. I'm also surprised. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, that's the attack drop. So, flamethrower coming off, and that is not gonna do a ton. No, it's not. No burn. No. Here comes the bite from Dreepy into Marini, and that will seal the deal on him. As it will. The Parish body activates, and there's only three turns left in this battle. <laughs> Spoilers. There's less than three. I, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think there's gonna be three. But. And the Cario's now small boy. 
Yes. But it's not over yet. And the car will resist extreme speed. And that's game. Game mm -hmm. is over. I have to hit the bone rush. Okay. There was a 10% chance I miss. Yeah. So. There's a 10% chance that I didn't lose just now. Lucaro is going to deal the final blow there, and Dreepy going to go for the big bite into Decidueye. Will he get the flinch? No flinch. Spirit Shackle is going to come off, and that is going to definitely deal the final blow to the Dreepy. Dreepy goes down, and that is your seventh cage match. Yeah, which makes it 3-4. Three, 3-4. Four. Three, four. Yeah. 3-4. That's... That's pretty balanced. Yeah. That's pretty balanced. How many uh how many smog on matches did you do this morning while I was sleeping, Dan? A lot. Okay. Yeah. Okay. A lot of practice. Uh-huh. I'm actually gonna give uh the Dynamax candy to Decidueye now. Uh yeah, I'm gonna get rid of Gookie Gang, because um that that eliminates your your bonus. Now we are going to head to the wild area, because now that we have the uh the floaty bike, we have two more encounters that we can do. One of which being the Lake of Outrage and Axu's Eye as well. Are you going for Lake of Outrage first? Uh, I'm gonna go get the claw, and then I'm gonna go to Lake of Outrage. Okay. And then I'll go to Axe's Eye. Okay. Okay, I'm in the Lake of Outrage. Everything, Mantike. Bellicent, Bear Scooter. Maybe that's him. Ah, I got nope. the Mantine. Yeah, you did. Ay. In rain, too, which is just lovely. Yep. I don't know if this thing gets Hurricane. Like, there's a chance it does, so we have to play this safe here, I think. I'm gonna nuzzle it. I'm gonna nuzzle it, but, it, like, if he goes for a water move, he could actually do a lot to me, so I'm just hopeful that he's just goes for Aqua Ring or something stupid. Bounce. That's what Well, I'm you're not gonna be able to throw a ball this turn. I'm gonna near it, nuzzle anyway. And you're gonna go fast and you're gonna miss. Uh, I was hoping he'd be Swift Swim. He was not. He missed anyway, so. Very good. Alright, let's nuzzle him. Chip away here a little bit. Oh my god, <laughs> So much. Well, yeah, it's four times effective, right? There's the aqua ring. Is he also flying type or just yeah, water? Yeah, he's flying water, so it's four times. Oh, and mine just did ingrained. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we picked bad encounters. Will we ever catch these Pokemon? Nice. Nice. What's the catch rate on Mantine? Not great. Not great. Not great. Oh! 25. 25. 25. Same as the starters. Alright, well, I'll nuzzle again. If I knock him out, then I knock him out. I mean. Ah. Uh, no encounter for Dan. You go for the Snover, too. How, how was that? Not bad. Made it work. It was a little rough, but not, <laughs> not the <laughs> worst. Oh, critical capture. That's another one. <laughs> That's your third. Hey. Let me go pee real quick. Okay, I'll wait here. I knocked out Barbiscuta. Did you really? Yeah, it was a crit in the rain. Okay, let me know when you have your red. Uh, ready to all right. Oh. Yeah. Three, two, one. I'm always a little fast. No, you got over faster. Well, I don't apologize this time. Well, I based it off of our timing, which was <sighs> ahead of real time. And I have a dupe, and I you have a pigeon. I have a pigeon. Here's my second egg. Well, my redo of my first egg. Hey! Ooh, a Vulpix. Vulpix. Now you got Vulpix. I have another ground. fire type. Yeah. To choose from. It's nighttime. I got the razor claw. We're going. Evolve, please. Did I did I do this right? I don't want agility. You have to learn agility. There you go. We did it. Sneasel has made it so long. Was this one of my first three? I don't remember. Future Austin, can we get the answer on screen? I think it might have been one of my. It was one of the early Pokemon, and I have a Weavile. Yeah. Oh my God! I can't believe it made it that far. Now it's just time for the dragons to evolve. The only reason it made it this far because it wasn't a threat, so you just left it there. <laughs> yeah. Let's just be real. I mean, I have the option of uh, Appleton or Decidui. I can actually use Weavile now! Yeah, look at you! Oh my god, all I need to do is evolve Kaiban, I have a fully evolved team! <laughs> and here I am with Dreepy still! I will say, actually, Weavile could be really good against Raihan. Raihan's gonna be tough though, he's got some really good stuff. I want you to come from the right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's kinda smart. 
Over here! Over here! <laughs> why, am I, why am I so good at Joy-Cons? Because of raves. <laughs> Imagine raving with your Joy-Cons, man. Oh wait, that's your Saturday night, my bad. Yeah. I don't know what is going on with this, with my comb over right now. Where's all my hats? <laughs> <laughs> nice hat there, Dan. Choo choo! Alright, where do we go? We go in here now? Probably. Seems like a good good bet. Hey, this is this the final gym? I thought we were supposed to do like the practice against his friends over on the side. No, there's battles beforehand. Oh, I guess this is it. So we're just doing the gym right now. Yeah. Why did I thought think that you had to battle like three of his friends that were double battles first? Because you do inside of the gym. Oh. Okay. You know how this is sometimes there's trainers before him. I get that part, but all right. I didn't realize you just jump right into it. I I feel like I thought you had to go to the like the place where the tapestries were. Yeah, that's where we're going. Oh. So you get a break in between, though. No? I mean, you get the break before you walk into the final battle. Okay. Like always. It's a long loading screen. That is a long loading screen. I'm the ready. rules are simple. Beep. All you got to do is defeat the three gym trainers that I personally trained in double battles. Dun, 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 dun. Naturally, there aren't too many gym challenges you can make it this far. Oh, you're already going in. Okay. This is this is, this is what the cage lock has trained us for this moment to be ready for double battles. This guy looks like a Brad or a Stanley. Um, Charles. Sebastian. S Sebastian. Sebastian works. Helper yeah. Sligus. He's got the the rain, the rain team, team strats. Okay. Lots of cries all at the same time. You've got assault. You could just stop his his weather with your stuff. Sure can. My goodness. Oh, hmm. what's that? You had a plan? I don't think so. No, no, no. How do I want to approach this? Mm. I see wind. Get the speed drop on the Pelipper and do some damage to the Sligoo. Not a lot of damage, but some damage. They cross chop into the Sligoo. Did that live? Yeah. It lived on one. It lived <laughs> what on was one that? health. Strange stream on the Sligoo for the KO. And he's got the water pulse in water. Uh, it's gonna tickle, but power gem into the Pelipper. Nice. Nice. Pelipper with the tailwind. Nice. You see the double strats. They're teaching you. Yeah. I love this. This is like. Oh, like there's one of my a, favorite thing. There's only two Pokemon. Yeah. Well. Budget cuts. <laughs> <laughs> That's not nice. Ryan spent it all on like internet and cable bills and <laughs> selfie sticks. Make sure he has the new phone. And I think they heal you between battles too. Oh, that would be th that would be helpful. Oh, I flinched. From what? Okay, so that wasn't too bad. I, I remember Air this slash. being harder, but again, I did use bug Pokemon, so... Air Slash flinch. You gonna wait for me? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm not good at that. No! <laughs> Thank you. No Camilla. Problem. It's Camilla, isn't it? Oh, I like Camilla. Yep, there it is. Nine Tails Turtonator. I knew it was coming. She's a little feisty. I knew it was coming. Oh, I still had Lucario! I didn't mean to do that! Oh, boy. Oh, there's no weather. Uh, this is not good. This is not good. Does Terminator... How does Terminator deal with fairy? Neutral? Because it's fire type? Yeah, it's neutral. This is not good. I put picked the wrong lead, and that's not good. I'm gonna lose him on here, I think. You think so? 100%. Oh, he went for the blast shell thing, which is not good. Mine did too. That's not good. That's all he does. That's his whole strat. Oh, Will-O-Wisp on the... On the special wheezing. See, you have the benefit here because it's not a drought. Yeah, you don't have the drought. So I, I mean, if they if they target down Sparky, Sparky. Oh, I did a lot of damage to my own wheezing. Oh, the trap doesn't work if you don't attack it. Oh, okay. what? My burn was healed. Yeah, that's weird. I don't know what happened. That's a thing. I, I don't, I don't know. Maybe it loves you. Did you put it in camp? No. I don't know then. He's gonna keep setting traps. That's all this guy does? He just traps the whole time? Yeah. I'm gonna wait for the, the sun to go away then. Isn't it if you hit it with a special, the trap doesn't work? Just like Marini? Uh, I th think so. I don't know if I wanna risk it. Not for the biscuit? This is very risky. Alright, I got rid of one thing. 
Oh, Lucario's learning Meteor Mash, dude. Nice. That's an upgrade over Bullet Punch. I mean, I lose the priority, but Meteor Mash is really strong. Yeah, that's that's what your team needs. Lucario to be stronger. Okay, I'm gonna trust that it's just special attacks. And I'm gonna actually go for the very bold charge move here. And then to I'm gonna- increase your spadef? Yeah, and then I'm gonna go for power gem. I'm gonna do a hyper voice well, on- Oh, he really does just do the shell trap thing. Yeah. That's all he does. I would use disable. Perfect, because I actually changed my move from sparkling aria to hyper voice for the double KO. So Look long- you learning! So long, Turninator. I really hope he doesn't attack me. Oh, one hit KO. Cursal is a monster. What can you do with the KO? Life we're in sync! Your strategy is... Austin. Aria. It's hail. Yep. With a, with a bomb of snow and Hakamo. With a dragon. Okay. The Hakamo is a little concerning for me. I can get rid of the uh, bomb of snow really easily right now. I'm more worried about the... Uh, the fighting move coming from it? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna hex. And I'm gonna meteor mash. I mean, I could double... Um, I mean, Lucario isn't... I think I'm gonna do the Sludge Bomb on a Bomb of Snow, and the Icy Wind on both for Hakamo, bringing its speed down. Oh, wow, Primarina is the fastest, that's really sad. Oh, it's a two-hit KO on Hakamo. Alright, I'm a little scared about the Hakamo, let's see what he's gonna do here. Don't you fighting move my... Oh, he's Shadow Claw. Oh, that might be bad, though. Hold on. Oh, we tank! We tankin! A bomb of snow down. Hey, tankin. Shadow Claw on Weezing? Yeah, Why? That's, that's gonna do nothing. Weezing's actually a beast. I think that was such a good pickup for you. Yeah. It's so bulky on the physical side, and it's got. Like, neutralizing gas is really cool. Yeah. Especially for right here. Yeah. What's Meteor Mash accuracy? 90? Everything's so low accuracy. Big risk, big reward. Wow. Big Dynamax. Yeah, it helps in Dynamaxing, but it's frustrating because it, I, I know inevitably he's gonna miss a crucial hit and it's gonna cost me a, a life. Or there's no his no, life. Yeah, his life. The final gym battle goes down now, right here, right now. We've come a long way in the last two, <laughs> three weeks. Yes. <laughs> Week and a half. What episode is this? Twelve. Week and a half. Here it is, Raihan. Ready to take self selfies. Yeah. This battle is is no joke, so... It's we'll, not. This is no joke. Oof. Alright. Maybe I shouldn't have led with Dreepy. <laughs> but it's a dragon, bro! That's all you need! He doesn't even- he's got like, what, two dragons? Alright, Gigalith and Flygon is his lead. Double Ultra Ball throw. That was a good throw on his end. Yeah. I really like how he did that. I'm going Weavile and, uh... Weezing Primarina. Okay. He's gonna set up the sand. Well, you have Lucario, so obviously you're, you win by default. Well, he's got ground moves and stuff, so I, I do have to be careful. The key here is just do not miss the Icicle Crush. My problem is I have Sparkling Aria, which will damage Weezing. I can't Icy Wind. You know what? I'm actually thinking... Is like... Rock weak to Ice? Is Rock weak to Ice? I keep thinking that... Everything that no, 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 no. water is good against, ice is good against. Yeah, it's not weak. Alright, I'm gonna go for... Actually, I can max Quake to get a special defense boost. Or I can max Fly Knuckle. Fly with the, the Steel Wing boost. on the Weezing. That I'm gonna max Knuckle. Hurt a little bit. Alright, let's see how this goes. I'm going for the Dynamax turn one. Really? I'm going for it. I got my Lucario. I'm gonna get these attack boosts. I got the Icy one for the speed drop. I think it somehow missed Flygon. Maybe I should have saved my Dynamax for the, uh, his Dynamax, but I'll get some boosts. Gigalith with the Stealth Rocks. I'm actually curious if Gigalith will live my attack here. Ice Crash, good. Didn't miss. Strange seems so good. It can miss, but it's pretty low chance. Uh, Hyper Voice is a sound-based normal move, which still is resisting into rocks, yeah. Yeah. I think you did live. Fly on with the Steel Wing again. This could be Weezing. bad. I might lose Weezing here. If he hits I have Weezing. I might lose Weavile, I mean. Oh. Oh, yeah, Weavile's dead. With the Body Press. Comment F down below for Weezing. The whole I mean, playthrough! The whole playthrough, man! It's I worked finally evolved! 
The whole playthrough I work for this thing, and that's what happens. Well, it looks like you're not gonna have any more beat-ups. Well, that's stupid. That's some stupid stuff. Stupid stuff right there. Ugh. I'm the sand Anaconda. Gigalith with the sand tomb. I'm gonna get a double. Isn't that just like fire spin, but ground-based? I'm annoyed. I just lost my Weavile! I spent all this time finally getting the Weavile, and then it dies! On this episode, because I don't kill the Jigalith. <laughs> the Jigalith? The Jigalith, man! I didn't kill the Jigalith! Uh, One job, kill the Jigalith! Grass Coast. Ugh. Well, I guess I can get a water type or something in my PC. I don't even know what's there, but I use my max knuckle. I got an attack boost on my deciduous forest here. I'm gonna be stronger now. Now my Leaf Blade's gonna do more damage. Goodbye, Sanaconda. I'm taking Weezing out, which is gonna get rid of the neutralizing gas. Oh, and then Sandstream starts right away. Didn't realize that. Yep. Years are. Oh, and then I got a cutscene about Sandstorm. Decidueye comes out to tank the Sparkling Aria. I should be the fastest on the field. Maybe Sandaconda's faster. Yep, with the Earth Power. And to Decidueye, it's gonna do nothing. Well, I wonder if I max Quake here for the special defense. Boost. How much is it gonna do? Is it double KO? Go for it, go for it. Yes! Double- No, Santa Cana's on one, dude. What? It's on one. <laughs> what? It's legit on one. <laughs> Pretty sure I see the little red bar there. Uh, that's oh, he's wild. living. He's living. Yeah. My man's going big tower here. Remember Skyline? Remember when I had, had Duraludon? <laughs> yes, I do. I remember. Those were the days. Those were the days. We've had some cool mods this playthrough when all is said and done. Wow, really loud. Yeah. That's the- that's the- the yelling. Rip to, uh, us. All right, here we go. Let's see how much this Mac Knuckle does. I'm plus two. The Mac Knuckle? That's game. Return of the Mac Knuckle. I just avenged my Weavile. I ain't playing games here, all right? Stupid. I needed Weavile. Weavile was really important on this team. It destroyed like three or four of your members. It did. It was a very important piece of the puzzle. Yeah. And here, he's gone now. Now I'm down I'm in the cage match. The final cage match of all. That's places. right. I could just Hyper Potion on Decidueye. And then Sparkling Art. <sighs> It's so weird being able to use items in a double battle. Oh yeah. Imagine he sends everyone in the stadium flying though. Like, sounds like a bad host. Yeah. No. Not. Like, <laughs> oh, the selfie though. It's like going to see, uh, you know, zookeepers, and they're like, "Oh, we're gonna let the lions go in the stands." <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go swimming with the killer whales. Yeah. What? Huh? The name's not fair, really. They're happy. Ooh, Max Steel Spike. That's my Into... Tickle. That might tickle. Prey Marina? Tanked it. She's a beast. You did tank it. She's a beast. Defense Rose. Yeah, but you'll be alright. Santa Ooh, with the glare on the Sedgeye. You're lucky it didn't double into the Prey Marina. Before your Icy Wind here. There you go. Santa Conda's down. They're out on so specially weak, like its special defense is so bad. So you just hit it with special attacks and then... Yeah, you're lucky that Santa Cana didn't attack you. Yeah. Because he went for glare, he, he choked. Yeah. He choked big time. Alright, so Decidueye is paralyzed, and uh, Primarine is not doing too hot. Alright, so I'm going to do Spirit Shackle into Duraludon and Primarina. Honestly, I think you just go Corviknight, he can't kill you at all. Right? Or you go Arcanine and get the Intimidate. No, because uh... Stones are on the field. Oh. I mean, either way, he's not... I don't think he can beat your Pokemon with potions and stuff. He doesn't have potions. No, I'm saying you. Like, oh, you have potions. yeah. You don't think he has enough power. Oh, you're saying my, my strategy should be potion yes. spam? I mean, hey, you gotta use it. Max Rockfall. Into the Corviknight. Into the Decidueye. Oh, that took more than half. Then again, it is, you know, a, a G-Max -G move. Duraludon can no longer escape. <laughs> Shucks for him! Yeah. Alright, so, tell you what, here's the plan. Decidueye is going to swap for Weezing. And Corviknight is going to heal the Weezing. Because it can't hurt Corviknight. So it's going to come out, it's going to get rid of the Sandstorm. No. Sandstorm, yeah, well. Sand's already up. Oh, yeah. You're gonna get rid of its ability, which is irrelevant here. But you run the risk of him going for a max steel spike into Weezing, which would be super effective. Yeah, but Weezing's gonna Gigantamax or Dynamax. 
Aim it for our fall anyway. Yeah, he's gonna do the same thing into Decidueye. Oh, into Corviknight. Oh no, that did a third of my health. Yeah, now if you go for Max Starfall, you're gonna just yep. obliterate him. Uh-huh. That's the plan. Weezing's getting big, team! That, that, those some big balls gonna be flying up in the sky there, Dan. That's gonna be a big... Is that Doug? What? Doug Dimmodome from Dimsdale Dimmodome? Doug Dale Dimmodome from Dimsdale Dimmodome. Doug Dimmodome. Doug. <laughs> Bruh. Doug. Sick dude. And we're gonna see the Roost coming off from the Corviknight. Bold strategy to heal himself up in this crazy battle we've got going on here. My game fell asleep. <laughs> Here comes the Max Starfall from Weezing! Well, not all of us can have a Lucario to just automatically Big damn win. I lost my Weevil, I don't wanna hear it. Aww. That was an important piece of my puzzles here. I can no longer beat up. I was counting on that. I should have done that in the gym, why didn't I do that? I would have died anyway. Oh, no, I wouldn't have died! I would have been able to knock out the Gigalith. Yeah. I could've just beat up myself, I should've done that. You should've. You literally talked about doing this here. Ugh. He's the Dragon Master with two dragons, come on, buddy. Yeah. Like, even Lance had more dragons than that. Yeah. Well, even though even though there was only the one dragon standing. line in the game. Yeah, it's funny. Oh man, here comes ha how. <laughs> he he loses the respect of having his name. So, all right, well Weavile, it was it was really nice knowing you. Rip to Weavile. Rip to Weavile. Luckily, I've got plenty of dark types around still. All right. And I still don't have any fighting types. And we are going to end this battle with our second cage match of the episode, which I'm feeling confident in. You're going in one down, and you've won the last two thanks to uh, Luke. Yeah, but I have two Pokemon with Max Dynamax Candy, which yeah. is pretty crucial. Uh huh. So we'll see how things play out. The semi -fi semi finale. The the one before the final. Arcanine Weezing. Robin Hoot and Luke. All right. I was a silly Billy and realized that neutralizing gas got rid of Intimidate. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I noticed that and I'm like, oh, I could take advantage of this. But that's unfortunate. I got bamboozled. I went for the the big boy play and it's going to cost me here. Mm. I, if I had Spirit Shackled your Decidueye, that would have been a big first turn. Yeah. I did not. Now the question is whose Decidueye is faster? I don't know. Is it going to be a speed tie or is it going to be mine? With a better nature. Robin Hoot with Sucker Punch, but it failed. And the Max Quake into the Weezing, uh, into the Arcanine slot for the Decidueye. Yeah. Right, still we're gonna lot, take that, though. no problem. Still did a lot, though. Alright, and the Sludge Bomb into Decidueye. Okay. Wish that did a little bit more. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Lucario's faster. Into the Weezing, tank. Oh, nope. Okay. I feel like I just took a max steel spike, no problem. I have, I'm not bullet punch anymore, it's meteor mash, so it's way stronger. Uh, it's like 130 instead of like 110 or 140 instead of 110. Mine's faster. Alright. Mm. We got ourselves an even playing field again. It's a real rough start. Go Dreepy! Go Dreepy! <laughs> time for you to maybe do something finally. Dreepy, it's your time, buddy. What did you misclick? I clicked on the wrong Pokemon. Oh. I, went, I just wasted my Max Knuckle. Max Knuckled into Dreepy? No, yeah, I meant to go into Corviknight, and I I had the Pokemon backwards in terms of where they were. Oh. That's huge. And I attacked the wrong Pokemon again. I thought they were flipped. I, I meant to double into Corviknight. There was no reason for me to attack Dreepy. Why would I attack Dreepy? The thing's useless. It doesn't do anything. Poor Dreepy. <laughs> I'm really annoyed, because I think I could have won if I didn't do that, but that's all right. Do you think that's going to be the... that This is the pinnacle point? That was it, because if I double Corviknight there, I knock it out, and I'm sitting there with two uh, attack boosts and everything like that. I mean, yeah, you have max turns, but I still have plenty of stuff in the back. I, ugh. It's annoying. It's annoying. I, I don't know how I messed that up. I flipped the two Pokemon around. I, for some reason, thought Dreepy was on the left and Corviknight was on the right. I don't know. You, you literally got to see them. I don't know what I did. I just clicked quickly. It's my own fault, but I'm annoyed at myself because I just, I'm going to lose because of it. But I could have just sent in Corsola. Mm. But I have a Tailwind up. But you wouldn't have if I attacked the right slot that I meant to attack. Right. That's what I'm saying. It is what it is. It's my own fault. I'm an idiot because I didn't pay attention. I'm annoyed at myself for that, though. Because now I'm going to lose the Arcanine. So, whatever. 
Well, it's not too late yet. I'm kind of with my back against the ropes. Well, not anymore, because this is going to destroy me. Is it, though? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. The question is, can I pick up the double KO with the Corviknight? Yeah. I don't think so. The yes. drill pack? So that's another thing, too. Like, I would have outsped if not for the Tailwind. Yes, this will go. Uh, maybe not. I have a defense boost. Yeah. I yeah, but I'm not going to do much, because I didn't get the attack boost from the... Yeah. GG's. Okay. There we go. Get rid of get rid of Marini. And the double KO on the field thanks to the tailwind. I'm I'm sorry. Yeah. No, I'm just annoyed because like it's like my own fault. Like it's not your fault. I'm just yeah. annoyed at myself. Like I I had such a clear path to victory. I had I had the game won and I just clicked the wrong Pokemon. I don't know what I did. I I don't know what why I targeted the wrong Pokemon. I just don't I don't know what I was doing. So it is what it is. GG's. Okay, so what are you picking your prize for? What are you getting rid of on my team? That would be Lucario. Okay, Lucario's gone. Yeah. All right. Dude, you went for the nuzzle? That was what I had to do. <laughs> Which I don't even think it's going to two-shot. Yeah, it doesn't even That's a foolproof plan. Yeah. GG's. Not gonna lie, without that misclick, I would have lost. Yeah. Yeah. It, yeah. It's, it's what it is. My fault. So it, it's pretty obvious I chose for uh, Lucario to be gone. So now we are both down our Lucarios, respectively. And we are gonna do the 10 Dynamax candy for Primarina. I'm gonna grab uh, Larvitar and um, Hatina are my two picks. So I'm gonna train them up. Great. And in our next episode, you are going to see the results of our training up. We're gonna hit Route 10, get another Pokemon, get another egg, and make our way to Winden. See you guys there. Thanks so much for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe if you guys are new, and the next episode will be up on Austin's channel tomorrow. Tomorrow. Sorry for the salt. That's that. Bye, guys. Peace. I'm not gonna lie, like I'm really salty. I don't know what. I know you're. I my feel head. the salt right here. I, I'm gonna need a fiver. Like I need five. But yeah. I don't know. Cause if if I knock out Corviknight there, you don't. So wait, wait. What you're saying is, what you're saying is, Dreepy won me the battle. Dreepy won me the battle. <laughs>